The county's planning agency, SANDAG, is months away from adopting a new regional transportation plan that aims to invest heavily in a network of new and improved bus and rail lines. But that plan will only get San Diego about halfway to its goal of slashing automobile commute trips in half by 2035. That's the conclusion of Thursday's report from the nonprofit Climate Action Campaign. Noah Harris is the group's transportation policy advocate. Unless the city and SANDAG work together to expand upon the proposed network and the regional plan, we're not going to achieve our climate goals for the transportation sector. Cars and trucks are San Diego's largest source of greenhouse gas emissions. Replacing car trips with biking, walking, and public transit is central to the city's climate action plan. Harris says city leaders will have to double down on strategies to re-engineer San Diego's suburban-style, car-dependent neighborhoods to be denser and more walkable. We really want this report to serve as a reality check for local elected officials that SANDAG is taking a great first step towards a more sustainable, a more equitable transportation future, but there's more work that needs to be done. The report was based on modeling from SANDAG. The agency's board of directors is expected to adopt its new regional transportation plan in December. Andrew Bowen, KPBS News.